What up? It is 730 July 26th. We're on the other side of the bay over here. At Sea Fourth Landing. Getting ready to go out on my boy Alex's charter. It's got a two day on the Highliner. Gonna be pretty sick. Hopefully we uh, we get into some of that 20 to 50 pound bluefin and then maybe uh, go up to the banks and see some shit, maybe Clemente or that Osborne, who knows. But it's gonna be a good one. We got some good people on the boat. Pura pesca style. Hey, hey dog. Be expensive on this go. Let's do it. Let's go. Two day highliner. Two day. What a pesca charter. We'll tackle recommendations. Make sure you have them. 250 to 300 gram knife jigs. We had good night fishing last night, and uh, all of our daytime fish have been, or 90% of them have been light line, light line, like 25 or 30 pound, with uh, smaller hooks number twos, number fours. So if you need to grab any of that, run up to the tackle shop. Otherwise, we will get everyone gathered up around the bait tank and get a head count and get out of here. All right, we're headed out. Hopefully we get to fish tonight at some point. So we'll be to the grounds around one o'clock. Just got this sick ass new windbreaker. Sheesh. Alright, we're all tied up, ready to go. I only brought four rods. So I got my got my Saltiga here. 25 pound small small circle hook. Got the Torium on the uh, Phoenix hybrid. 40 to 60 with a cold sniper, the Fathom 40, the Seeker 20 pound, and then I got the Saltiga just freshly serviced. Kind of blew up on me last trip, but got it all back. Got new bearings in it, got the drag all greased up. Hopefully, it's uh, good to go, doesn't fail me this time. I put a 300 gram SK jig on there. Phoenix Railroad should do the job there. The guy right here is tying up the clear popper. Sheesh. Sick. Alright, y'all. It's like 2 30. Just found our first sign of fish here. Cap said, go ahead and drop. You want to drop it down right here and get after it. Let's see what we got. Alright y'all, that's it. Our third or fourth stop here. Trying to get a bite. First biter. Eee. Let's go. Boys on. Let's get it. Nice. One on the boat here. Small yellow fin. It's about 4.30, probably made about four or five stops here. Got maybe a fish to two fish per stop. I think we're sitting at about five fish right now. Smell breakfast starting to cook up. Hopefully we can uh, take this night bite into a gray light bite here. Have something good going for us. Good job. Good job, dude. But 
but let's go. Got a couple fish, let's go. All right, what'd you get that one on? Uh, rip roller, 300, nice. 80 pound floral and 80 pound braid. Nice, so we switched up from the sinker bomb there and uh, stuck on that Mustad rip roller and got bit. Seemed like those fish were sitting a little higher in the water column, so probably a better choice. Kind of fluttered down there, took a little longer to get down there, I'm Remember sure you got- we had to go through three, four different sets of lures. Yeah, though, exactly so. Stuff, so. Yeah, he found it, so we're gonna we're gonna stick with that like 250 to 300 gram jig and see if we can uh, I, score a couple more. I think big key is how vertical that thing goes, honestly. 100%. I, I felt like I got hit immediately when I was going down. Pretty quick. Bringing back in, on. Well, let's go, guys. The wind's up a little bit, current's up a little bit, so we gotta kind of cast those jigs down swell a bit. But uh, 440 right now. 440. Hey. Probably got what five fish, almost five fish on the boat. I think one's down there in the drop, so. Five fish, not doing too bad. Let's hopefully uh, get a good stop here and put some numbers together. Let's go, dog. Oh, yes. Thank you, brother. Day one of the two day. How many fish do you think we got so far? A little nine bluefin and four yellowfin. Sweet nine bluefin, four yellowfin. It's been been a slow plunker bite here. Kind of got to get a get a real good bait out to get bit. I've been struggling. I barely just got my first one here about five minutes ago. It's been a tough bite. Just got to keep working at it, keep grabbing baits, and hopefully one of them gets bit here. We got one guy on right here. Let's go. She's fucking killing it. How many you got? Seven. Well, I hooked up seven. Jesus. Good job. She's killing it. She's fucking got two to three times as many as anybody else. So she's doing something right here. Just got to keep plunking away at it here. Slowly but surely. Boat's sick though. I like the layout of the boat. Everything's been cool. A lot of room. 
The AC is kicking down there, dog. That shit is nice. That's one thing about this boat. It's cold down there. It's nice. So that's definitely a plus, but we're going to get back out here. Get yeah, Alex yeah. hooking one here. Day one of the charter house. Day going. one, it's going. It's tough little, bite, but you got to get on it. Yeah, got to get a good bait, bait out there. Yeah. Get it's a bit for sure. Plunker bite. Small we see them blowing up here. Singles in the in the distance here. It's just yeah. fucking got to get a good bait out on them. So it'll turn right now. Yep, gonna get back out there and get fishing. Oh, thank you, brother. Appreciate you guys. Nice. <laughs> First one. First bluefin. Damn, you know what that means. Do it. Let's eat the ass. Let's go. <laughs> oh, throw up. All right. A bite? First, yeah, just a bite. First fucking bluefin right here, boys. Yeah. What does it taste like? It tastes like cookies. Yeah. He lied to you. Those are the balls. Those are the balls. <laughs> That's a real man right there. Let's go, boys. Good shit. Pura pesca style. Yeah. Like all right, y'all, I'm not sure exactly what time it is here. It's kind of midday, but we're up at the 60 mile bank, doing a little rock fishing. Might as well catch some fish here while the bite's a little slow, so. Fucking getting us some tacos. All right, folks, the red tuna bite is insane. On the highliner, the fucking red, the red snapper tuna. <laughs> All right, it's 516. Just starting to see some bluefin again. Trying to get a bite here. Just uh, threw some scoops on a school right here and had it boil up behind the boat pretty good. So hopefully it'll start to bite here in the next next few stops. We can start get it going and get ready for this night bite. Seems like we located some fish though, so that's good. So we can be in good position for the nighttime. So let's try to get it here. Got to get a good bait out there. It's still the name of the game here. Get a bait to swim away from the boat, you get bit. We'll get back to you here soon. No worries. I got it. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Alright, let's go, Mark. Pull it up all over the barrier. Don't do that, motherfucker. <laughs> it sees the surface and it just is like. Fuck you. Right here. We're gonna kill him. We're gonna kill him right here. Doggy. My guy. I want you guys coming down with this. My guy. Let's go. Woke up from that nap, got on a little little fly line. Let's go. Let's get it. Let's get it, dude. Let's get it. Nice one, oh, yeah. fuck yeah. Right, Stoked. Yep. Oh. I'm gonna have free spools. Alright, look for this gap in the bow to do delicious pork chops asparagus and mashed potatoes got on a little gray light bite right there or a sundowner bite we're still on that pork chop bite that's for sure how many do we get right there probably like five six, five, six something like that probably like six fish 
just slowly adding add to our limits here. Uh, feeling like we're gonna have a good night tonight. Everyone's gonna be up, well rested, jigging. It's our last night here fishing, so we got tomorrow and tonight, so we gotta make it happen here, so. Just fueled up, gonna get back out there and get ready to drop a jig here. All right, I think it's around midnight. Just started our first couple drops here. Let's go, dog. You just had it back there. You get it? Yeah, I got it. Fuck yeah, dog. Let's go. I think we just got two on the boat. It's our first good stop of the night here. Oh, yeah. Look at that spike there. All right, guys. That's what we left us. Let's line him up. Sweet. We're going to get moving. This freaking dude, this harness came in freaking doing wonders. Hell yeah, dude. You did a great job. Awesome. All right, let's get back on some more here. Get ready to drop again. All right, it's like one o'clock. Just made another stop here. Got a couple of fish. Oh yeah. Sweet. Nice fish. That's cool. I'm done. Let's wind them up. Try to find it again. Just realized it was hooked. What the fuck? That thing just came right up. Gap, 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 gap. It's all right. Nobody freak out. It's all good. Do we both got the same fucking fish, dog? No, I'm down. I'm at the bottom. I'm just. It's here. Okay, cool. I got a floater. We got a little football. I got a floating football. Drop it down a little deeper now. 350 feet. I just pull him on. I was like, wait. How the fuck do I feel you? I'm way the fuck over there. Your fish grabbed me. <laughs> All right, ready? Two. One, two. It's so cute. Oh, oh. Damn. All good. It was too little. We had to live. I don't give a fuck about that one.
coming under you, yeah. I think I'm on. Oh. Am I on? Yeah, yeah my fish is maybe. Shit, is it yours? Are you on there? Fuck, man, I just pulled the fucking hooks again. Are you? Are you going to Are we? God damn it. Hey, those are bigger ones. Nice. Fish all the way over here. Whose fish is that? Whose fish is this? Hey, whose fish is all the way over here? All the way on the other side of the boat here. Just wrap me. No, no worries. I'm just letting you know where where he's at. Yeah, boys. A little night bite going. Oh yeah. Nice fish. Fresh one. Fresh one, pura pesca. Shit, boys. It's probably like 330. Pushing four o'clock probably. Been fucking knocking a few fish out here. A few at a time. I pulled the hook twice on this stop. All good. Having a great time. Alright, it's 445. Still stopping on fish. No shortage of fish here. Just trying to get him to stick with the boat start biting probably gonna get into some gray light bite right here start fly lining got 60 more fish to go to meet our limits here so gotta keep grinding at it it's been fun as hell though so far so let's get it let's get on the rest of these fish all right y'all it's the next morning time. getting ready to eat some breakfast here How's it tasting of? Fire. Nice. We had a long night. I think I got maybe two hours of sleep. Really? But yeah, maybe. What did I get? What do we go? What, five o'clock, right? Right when the sun was coming up? What is it, seven right now? What'd you get? I got like three hours. Three yeah. hours? A couple hours? Two to three hours? Yeah, kind of like. Night, yeah, like I was saying that the sun was coming up when I was going to sleep for sure, so. We ended up with a decent amount of fish last night. I think the guys that maybe didn't get to pull on on the first night definitely got to pull on some. And it was super fun, so try and find a little bit more fish here before we got to call it a trip. And well, we got a, we got quite a quite a few hours today, so hopefully we'll uh, we'll locate some more some more fish, maybe some yellowtail, and end the trip off good. But it's been fun so far. Let's go. All right, well, it's like 1047. We're out here working into the east, trying to find some kelps. Seemed like that tuna wasn't really getting with it this morning. Had our shot at night, that's all we got. Work out here, weather's super nice, water's nice and blue. Got a surface iron tied on. Hopefully we can uh, manage to wrangle up some yellow till here. That'll be fun. So, been a good trip so far, it's been fun. Not the most fish, but good people, good times. Boat sick, so Let's see if we can capitalize here at the end of the day, end of the trip. Let's go. All right, y'all. It's like one o'clock. It's been slow, slow. Been just driving around searching for kelps. I think we found three kelps so far. Two of them holding a couple yellowtail, a couple dorado. But other than that, not seeing much. They're definitely not biting, that's for sure. So, I'm gonna keep looking here. Just had lunch. Got a couple more hours left to go, so try to make the best out of this. We'll see. We'll see. 
All right, I just woke up from a nap. It's like 3, 30, 4 o'clock, something like that. I think we're headed in. I'm calling it. It's been a good trip. For sure. Stoked to come out with the boys. Pulled up Esca. And a sick charter. Five fish total for the two day. It was pretty sick. Stoke. phenomenal nothing short of amazing honestly I mean I'd say the best crew I've came with in the past fucking two years dude these guys all work so well together got each other's backs pretty much how it should be you know super dope to see Night driver was fucking awesome. Homie Mike putting us on the fish. Captain Jason doing his thing in the daytime. Deckhands, Mike, Mason, and Max. Fucking killed it. Absolutely killed it. These guys are awesome. Definitely come back on this boat. Be back soon. I definitely recommend uh, coming out and checking them out. All right, y'all, that's a wrap. We are back here in Mission Bay. Good-ass trip. Thank you, Alex. We appreciate you, know you it. man. Good trip on the Highliner. You know it, you know it. I think we all got some fish to go home with. We got rockfish. We got bluefin. We got yellowfin. <laughs> Stoke. Crew was fucking dope. You guys, come check them out. Let's go. I don't come out of Mission Bay too often, but definitely come back over here for this boat. Well, see you guys out there.